answer to the Colorado quiz. For whom were the fantastic formations of the Wheeler Geologic Area named? It was Lieutenant George Wheeler who headed up surveys of the region during the 1870s for the United States Army. Welcome back to Colorado Getaways. For generations, the Manto family has ranched up in the remote regions of northwest Colorado. Scott Sander and photographer Eric Bloomer found out that you can go ranching with them up in Hayes Canyon. Well, she hired on a chicks in the big sky valley, breaking colts and wrangling dudes. She knew she'd deep into this forbidding country, and you can take a step back in time. Uh, I was on the homestead address in 1918. Was it Chris Spring? More than an hour from the nearest paved road in the heart of Dinosaur National Monument lies Hell's Canyon and the Mantle Ranch. Tim and Lonnie Mantle grew up here with their family. They worked cattle, built cabins, and rode some of the roughest terrain in Colorado. I can remember when I was a kid, everything was a horseback, and I thought everybody was a horse. Everybody had to live with a horse. Lonnie Mantle learned his first lesson in survival as a boy when he cut his leg open during a snowbound winter in the canyon. So we came here to this house, and uh, what to do? He couldn't get to a doctor. So they laid me down on the bed, and they got the needle and thread out, and they started to work on her. And I was carrying on a little bit, and my dad said, well, he said, you're going to either have to take it or I'm going to have to knock you out. For years, the family survived off their cattle business. But times have changed. They can't run enough cattle to make the business worth it. Still, they cannot imagine the place without the cattle. They're kind of like us. They've been here a long time. They don't need either. So the youngest generation of mantles has found that different times demand different approaches to surviving. They have opened their doors to anyone who is interested in paying for the opportunity to test themselves on a horse in this challenging country. It's not really a vacation, you can't call it just a trip, it's sort of just a, an experience, it's just a, it's a, a week of reality. During this week of reality, you will help run the ranch by riding century-old trails with Kale and Renee Mantle. <laughs> I mean, there's an adrenaline rush when you get done with the trail, you can't believe you just survived that. And I mean, you want to pat yourself on the back and say, Wow. And you said you get to the bottom of the canyon and the sun burn the top of your roof, your mouth, or looking up at it. <laughs> Stay with the mantles and you will enjoy LaRue Mantle's hearty and wholesome meals cooked the old fashioned way. There's no running water or uh, no electricity. No running water? No problem. Here you can just drink from the purest stream or relax in the Yampa River where your hosts will deliver your horses right to you. At night, you sleep in the old bunkhouse where one room stays naturally cool because it's built directly into the sand rock. For entertainment, you can watch Kale Mantle offer a tow to passing rafters. And you can trade TV for the trolling. the day you relax to a little cowboy music or even some cowboy poetry. But the greatest stories I ever heard always involved two common words. The words describing that menacing bucking horse. And then you can head back to civilization with a better sense of what it took to survive in Colorado at the turn of the last century. The mental heritage is what is important about this place. And the men and women who grew up here they're still alive, and they want to share that history with people now and show them what it really is like. And there are not going to be a lot of opportunities like that for very much longer. To reach the Mantle Ranch, travel west on Highway 40 through Steamboat Springs and Craig to the small town of Dinosaur. The ranch is located in the heart of Dinosaur National Monument.